Hi, I'm Emil, the practical engineer, and today I'm making an automatic bubble machine. I tried a couple of different ways to make the bubbles and what I figured was that the things that work best to make the bubbles are the things that are made to make bubbles, which are these things that are found in the, in the children bubble toys. So I bought 12 of these, so I can use the, this part in my bubble making machine. But we'll start with the housing of the machine. cut I have these panels over here I have the back panel with the hole for the fan and I have the panel with the hole for the motor and the hole where the air is blown through to make the bubbles time to mount So the base of the machine is done. Here in the front is where the motor is going to be with the bubble makers over here. Then here in the back I made this funnel that will guide the air from the fan to the place where the bubbles are being made. So next thing to do is paint it. And if you don't like painting, remember this trick. So the painting is done. Next thing we need to do, we need to mount this to hold the liquid in here. I need to make the rotor for the bubble making thingies place it with the motor in here and then we put the fan in the back and close everything. I'm gonna make the axle for the bubble machine from this piece of aluminum on my lathe. But before we move over to the lathe, we first have to drill a couple of holes in here to hold the, the bubble maker thingies. To drill the holes nice and in a consistent place, I made this little jig. It's a V with a screw in it, so when I place this, it has a stopper and I can place the drill exactly perpendicular to the material. Also I made this little scale so I know exactly where I need to drill. The bubble making thing is mounted. Next up, we can move to the back. 
put the fan on the back panel, put the power inlet and put the switch on it, put it together, fill it up and test it. So it's all assembled, let's fill it up and try it. So if you like this video, you might like this video as well. Hit that subscribe button before you leave and don't forget, dare to experiment and have fun creating.